So tonight we're working on the explosion of, uh, of the landing zone where the Joes are. This is the killing of all our Joes. Um, so we're very excited. It's our first explosion for the whole movie. And we have basically that thing up there, that Hummer up there, we're going to blow 20 feet up. That's what they tell me, 20 feet this way. We planned and planned and planned for this. We storyboarded every moment. We looked at every explosion, and there's a lot. And, and with explosions, there comes a danger. So we have to be extremely careful. You can't just go and shoot. We knew before we ever rolled camera exactly where everybody dies, when everybody dies, what charges are going there. We had everything marked out on our maps. And as we were walking through it, we'd add something or take something away or add more people here. And that was all done during a, a several day rehearsal process. Keep checking your wiring, guys. Make sure we're all good. We had our hero charges that were all buried and stuck in the ground, usually the much bigger charges. And then we had charges that we could place anywhere. The special effects guys would run around, dig a quick hole, put a pot down, put a charge right there. Side, this one's off your, kind of off your back. Boom, and they take you out right here as they come through. We've got an excellent stunt team. And at the same time, we have to fold in my people who are uh, active duty uh, special boat unit people and Navy SEALs that are doing the tactical uh, movement in the foreground of the shot. But yet I have to keep them out of harm's way of the uh, effects. So the stunt people have to work in the effect region. Uh, and my guys are in front of that. So uh, keeping those two zones separated and not having our guys wander into areas where they shouldn't be and vice versa is is a challenge. You look silly as shit. Eyes on him. I was watching. Hey, <laughs> When we were doing those scenes and watching just the Humvee just explode and go 30 feet in the air, I was like, this is a war movie. It was just pretty cool. I think there are moments where I feel like I can't imagine what this would really be like if this was all real, and 10 times is horrific. And then there's also moments where I'm like, I get to play soldier right now. I'm getting paid to do this. The action sequences were, were a struggle at times, but if you want to be in a military movie, you want to be in a G.I. Joe movie, Merry Christmas.